One of the main components of Majuri's mask is, well, masks. And while it might have looked fairly hard to obtain some of them, there are some easy and quick tricks that can help you. But it would be boring if we would just list the ones that are quick to obtain. So let's check out the 5 fastest masks to obtain with the use of glitches. We will obviously exclude masks like Bremen Mask, Cafe's Mask, Chimera Mask and the Great Fairy Mask because they're really easy to get normally as well. So let's get started. Number 5. Captain's Hat This one is meant to be one of the longer and more difficult ones to get your hands on. We have to go to Ikana Kenyon's graveyard and wake up Captain Kita here by playing the Sonata of Awakening in front of him. This will start a race and turns into a fight once we caught up to him. After defeating him, he rewards us with a captain's hat. But we wouldn't mention this if there wasn't a much easier way of obtaining this mask. The flame circle that surrounds the chests with a mask inside can be bypassed. But first we need to get up there. And depending on where you are, this can be rather difficult. We can use the Goron mask to get on top of the lamp that is above Dampe's door and perform a fairly precise jump to get onto the bridge from here. Or we perform a weird shot where we force the camera out of bounds. We explained this in several other videos already, you can find the link in the upper right corner. We use this to hookshot the chest from here and then continue. If we fail to catch up to Kita, we can just go onto the other side of the bridge and get up using a series of backflips. So that one's fairly easy. From here we can use the hookshot once more. We hookshot the chest and get hit by the fire. If we're fast enough, we can hookshot the chest once again while still burning, which makes us invincible to fire and we can open the chest with the right timing. Obviously, there are other ways to perform this trick. While these might be easier to execute with the proper glitch knowledge, these are also extremely hard to explain from scratch. So we'll scratch that. Number 4. The Gibdo Mask Originally, we have to make the Gyptos disappear by learning and playing the Song of Storms to get the music box to work again. This will get rid of the Gyptos with a tune that reminds one of the Big Boo's house of Super Mario 64 and gets the water running again. After this is done, Pamela will come outside and we have to sneak into the house. Or we just use a bomb and clip ourselves into the house and then enter the loading zone. Here we then lure her father out of the closet and play the song of healing to save him from the curse. Probably one of the most tragic stories of Majora's Mask that certainly could have needed some more attention. Number 3. Don Garo Mask As the baby in Goron Village falls asleep, the torches at the top get lit. If we use a Deku stick here and light up all the torches in Goron Village, we can make the pots on the top start rotating again and use the ramp to destroy them. In one of the pots is a hidden rock sirloin that we can feed to a hungry Goron who will give us the Don Gero mask in return. So far the normal way of doing it. However, it wasn't really known up until 2014 that it isn't needed to light up all the torches if we simply use a fire arrow and light the chandelier itself. But this isn't where it stops. Actually, we don't need a Goron mask at all. It's enough to perform a glitch called bomb hovering a couple of times, which is a glitch that lets us float in the air when shielding damage and use this to get to the desired pot as human link. If we're in the right spot now and roll, the game will break the pot and we can pick up the rock sirloin. However, if we want to skip the Goron mask for this altogether, we have to make sure to be on the Japanese version, as Zora Link can only carry this delicious treat on this version. Number 2. The Keaton Mask Obtaining the Keaton Mask is part of the Lover's Quest, which we're only meant to get on day 3 after the Bomb Keeper's mother got robbed two days earlier. First we have to arrange a meeting with Cafe on day 2, who will then make sure the door is unlocked for us on day 3. There is an easier way to get the mask though. A really easy way. We get the bomb bag and a couple of bombs, then place ourselves on the edge next to the wall and place a bomb in front of us. Now we just put on Deku Mask and let the bomb blast us off the ledge. The combination of backwards momentum along with the ability to jump in water gives us the perfect angle to clip into the loading zone of the house. And due to the fact that you're only allowed to be in there on day 3 if you did the previous parts of the quest, there won't be a check in place either. So just talk to the curiosity shop owner and you get your mask, regardless of whether you started the quest. Number 1. The Blast Mask 
This one might seem a little odd because there's no real precondition to this mask. Just be there on the night of the first day at 12.20 am and make sure Seikon doesn't run off with his loot. However, there is a way to speed things up, as you usually have to play Song of Double Time to get to night 1 and then wait a long time for it to turn 12 am. If you're on the Japanese version and perform a glitch called bottle duping by for example selling an item to the curiosity shop and then switching the item before actually selling it, you can turn masks into bottles. These are relatively ordinary bottles, however, unless you catch hot spring water in them, which forces the game to try and change values in an unintended spot in the game's memory. Long story short, if we perform this with the cafe's mask and catch hot spring water, the game time will immediately jump to 12 a.m. at night. This can also be done for the Don Gero mask on the English version, as we can force the game to give us a rock sirloin without breaking any pots. But that will be used in another video. Thanks for watching everybody, it's great that you're here. Be sure to click all the bells and whistles. No really, the subscribe button has a bell now. Why aren't you clicking it? Then you will be notified. Don't you want more epic videos? Of course you do! Then click the thingies! Also, tell us in the comments what you thought about this video and give us a, l a lovely like.